Have you ever wondered how Python remembers your shopping list, your GPS coordinates, or even your stock tickers? All the answer lies within its built-in data structures. Data structures are backbone of Python programming. They are different ways of organizing and managing the data. Each one of them have certain strength, which makes them perfect for certain type of job. Take list. They are ordered and flexible. You can add, remove, or change items within the list at any time as you want. Think of your shopping list update or any stock price updates daily basis. List type of data structures allow duplicates and it is ordered. You can access the values at the index level. Tuples are somewhat similar like list, but they are fixed and unchangeable. Once assigned, you cannot change it at the index level. Perfect for the values that should never shift, like GPS coordinates or usernames or passwords, etc. Next are sets. They are unordered and they store unique values. Great for removing duplicates, like storing unique customer IDs, unique product IDs, and finally, dictionaries the power of keys and values. They store the relationship between keys and values. Let's take an example. Name goes with data speaks. Platform goes with YouTube. Category goes with data science. Video goes with data structures. So these are the keys and values. They are blazing fast when you need to look at the values by the keys. Behind the scenes, lists are dynamic arrays, where sets and dictionaries use hash tables, and tuples are optimized for speed. These differences can seriously impact the performance when you are working with large size of data. This was super lightning fast overview about the data structures. I have made individual videos dedicated to each data structures in my YouTube channel with the coding example. Please do not forget to check those and subscribe so you do not miss what's coming next.